Good morning guys, long time no chat. I missed you guys so I thought I would do just a daily vlog today. I'm probably gonna do some more of like a Sunday reset because I need to get this house in order. The kitchen is like pretty much clean but I definitely need to pick up the rest of my house. And I just thought it would be nice and cozy to just bring you guys along. So I'm gonna make breakfast real quick, first of all. And I wanted to show you. So I just recently got a Ninja Creamy for my birthday and I'm absolutely obsessed with it. I've tried the ice cream setting and the smoothie bowl setting. So today we're going to be making a smoothie bowl. Mine, I honestly don't know which version it is. I got it as a gift for my birthday, but it came with two different cups. So this is what I do for ice cream it's basically like a protein ice cream which is absolutely amazing i basically just do like a protein shake which is like one i do one and a half servings so one cup of one and a half cup of oat milk and then one and a half scoops of protein powder of choice i like the my protein this is the mocha flavor i've also tried the salted caramel flavor absolutely amazing but today we're going to be doing a smoothie bowl and on this one, I just add one frozen banana, some blueberries, and a small teaspoon of the Biscoff cookie butter. This thing is so good. It will make any of your smoothie bowls taste amazing. So I'm just going to drizzle like literally a little bit of milk in here just to help it get softer. So the first time I tried it, I literally had to spin it like 20 times because I didn't know what I was doing. And then the ice cream one... I guess you have to like make sure it's really really properly like overnight frozen because the first time I spun it it literally like looked like soft serve but it didn't taste like ice cream necessarily it was kind of more like a smoothie bowl consistency so then I let it freeze some more and then it's gonna come out like powdery so you add a little bit of milk and it's like the perfect consistency I will be making one tonight and I will show you guys so I'm just gonna add a little drizzle of milk into the smoothie bowl I know it's technically like this is such like a summer item and I am very far behind but it's just so good. I saw that Baby Hay got one recently and that's what kind of inspired me to put it on my birthday wish list. And trust me, it is worth the hype and I'm definitely late to the game. But so excited. So I'm going to place this whole thing. So this is my finished smoothie bowl. I just put one entire banana and then this granola. It's from Costco. It's so good. It's like more it's like soft, crunchy. It's not like a hard, hard granola. It's like chewy. That's the word I'm looking for. And it's so good. So I'm going to enjoy my little smoothie bowl. And then I probably have to stop by Costco real quick just to buy a couple things. And then we will get to resetting this house. I just made it back from Costco. I bought ground beef and sweet potatoes because I literally eat the same thing every single day and it includes both of, both of those things. So my downstairs is not too terribly messy. Like my kitchen is pretty organized. I have some dishes that I used for breakfast this morning, but my stove top, it's a gas stove top and it literally becomes disgusting in two seconds so i'm gonna clean that real quick and then i have a couple things on my kitchen island because it's literally a catch-all no matter how much i try it just i keep dumping things on it and then i'm gonna fix up my couch and then we gotta clean up my bathroom so those are the little things i gotta do and then i want to wipe off every single surface i have in this house so let's get started because it's gonna be a long day but I do have the Ninja Creamy ice cream to look forward to at night, which I'm so excited. Oh, and of course we cannot forget, I gotta reset myself. So I'm gonna do an everything shower, wash my hair, do a little hair mask, shave everything, exfoliate, all that good stuff. So let's get into it.
return these things for like a couple weeks and I am afraid that the return window actually expired. So I should probably get to that either today or tomorrow. So my kitchen looks pretty good. I'm gonna move on to my couch. I honestly did not have to do much to my kitchen because I literally just cleaned it last night. But my boyfriend made his breakfast this morning. You know how guys are, they don't know how to clean up after themselves. So I just had to do a quick little touch up. However, I do have that bag from the lake that I went the other day and I have yet to pick it up. So now let's move on to my couch because as you can tell, it gets a lot of love and I don't pick it up as much. So I'm going to fluff it up, pick it up, and then I'm going to spray and wipe down all of my surfaces down here. Like, I literally have bikinis thrown around. It's bad, guys. console it's from Amazon and I like the design but it was just so bad quality and badly built this drawer is obviously not even and like the slightest little touch it just makes it open <sighs> do not recommend but you live and you learn see what I'm talking about I've been using this walking pad that I got and I love it it's very nice to walk with but like it's a hassle to take on and off it technically folds and I put it into my coat closet of my hallway but it's not like the easiest to fold so like if I use it every single day I leave it out but I am going to pick it up and then I'll just put it back out the next time I'm gonna use it So the downstairs is basically all done. I just need to bring up everything that is on top of my dining table, as well as these tennis shoes that I use for the walking pad. <sighs> Why am I out of breath from that? The thing is that it's easy, it has wheels, but like moving it sideways, not so easy. I'm moving on to my bathroom, which is like the main other place that I have to clean today. And then we're gonna do an everything shower afterwards. Honestly, not gonna lie, I had so much motivation when I woke up to make this video and like to do a whole reset. And then after going out and going to Costco and I came back home, I'm like, I don't wanna do anything. I just wanna lay in bed. And that's honestly my issue, like, 90% of the time so like I make these videos to like motivate you guys but also motivate myself because if I'm not making the video I I don't do it okay I need to bring up the beach bag everything on the dining table and I'll see you upstairs <sighs> the reality of having to come back for your camera up we go. So my bathroom's a little bit of a mess. I just gotta pick up the counter, clean it, clean my shower, clean the toilet room, and then we should be good to go. Dude, I don't understand. I go to the gym like four or five days a week. Why am I so out of breath? <sighs> okay, let's start by just putting everything on the counters away. Okay, 
now that it's all nice and picked up at least let's clean down the counter and the sinks and then we will get into the actual shower I just cleaned the toilet off camera because I just find that a little bit gross and now we're moving on to the shower so because I have a glass shower the glass unless you wipe it every single day like it will automatically have like hard water stains and I'm not about that life so I use the CLR calcium lime and rust remover spray it is absolutely amazing it's the best thing I've ever found so I'm gonna roll up my pants don't mind me I'm gonna look a little bit crazy and we're gonna get this done. <coughs> I will say it's very fucking strong. So, just a warning. So for the floor, it has like a whole bunch of different head attachments, so I will link it down. I will link it in the description because I absolutely love it, but just bring some Lysol on the floor. Okay, so now that that's all nice and clean, let's get ourself clean because I feel disgusting and full of chemicals. So we're going to do an everything shower, wash our hair wash your face, exfoliate, shave, everything. Let's get into it, because I want to just cozy up and lay down. just got out and I kind of want to German plane my face so I use the Tinkle face razors with a little bit of oil and I think I'm gonna do that because my face feels extra dry and I need to exfoliate it so so I'm gonna be using a little bit of the Anua cleansing oil Is disgusting I'm gonna wash my face and then we'll be back I used to be the type of person that would do like a 20 step skincare routine and the older I got the more I learned that my skin responds better to like literally just like the most minimal skincare so I wash my face morning and night with the peach slices acne cleanser and it is the best I have found to keep my acne in under control because it has salicylic acid. The moisturizer I use is the Naturium Multipeptide Moisturizer. I use this every morning. And then at night, I like to incorporate the La Roche-Posay Salicylic Acid Acne Treatment Serum. It is the best thing, holy grail, favorite product I've ever used in my life. And that's it. And I don't do anything else. I probably should start using some like retinum serum or something because I am getting older but I don't know I just feel like my face does best with like minimal skincare 